channel it's me your little boy Samson. I have something special for us today you know they are scared of losing you and at the same time they are jealous of what you have let me tell you choosing once not that we don't need woman we need each other in order for us to accomplish our purpose on earth because if truly we don't need people why is it that Christ come and select 12 disciples. So the real truth is this, we need some people, but not every people, not everyone. That's why out of thousands of people that Christ meet, out of thousands of people that Christ contact, have communication with, eat with, drink with, do all sorts of things with, he always only select what? 12 people. And out of that 12 people, he still have a mystic around them. <laughs> you got to say, if Judas is carrot, is a mystic. <laughs> but it's not a mystic. It's, it's what, what the fulfillment of the what, of the scripture. So what am I trying to say is this. They are scared and jealous of you. Why? Because let me tell you, you don't need them. They need you. But the truth is this. Many of them cannot do without you. This is just the fact. This is something that it will be very difficult for someone up there to let you know how what how 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 important you are how how great you are towards those you are thinking that they don't love you the real truth is this they truly need you as badly as they truly want to breathe why because they can't do without you it's just like someone who is trying to live without oxygen Someone who is trying to live without air. Someone who is trying to live without water. It's impossible. Why? Because as the moment you eat food, you have already drink water. The moment as I'm eating this fruit now, you come to realize that we have what natural what water. Because without water, the fruit will not do what will not be what it will not produce, increase and etc. So what am I trying to say is this: they need you. They truly do what you need every single thing about you that is why people will treat you bad but the moment you are trying to go they will become so scared you know what i'm saying they are scared of letting you go because most time they will not value you most time they will not respect your presence most time they will not let you know that you are so important because they don't want you to know how how what how needed they, they do what they need you how seriously they do or they truly need you. Why? Because they want you to make they want you to come to that point where you will make them feel like they love you. Where you will make them feel like you need them. Where you start to make them feel what you feel like they, you need them mostly, not they need you. But the real truth is this as a choosing. You have all it takes to prosper. You have all it takes to be successful. You have all it takes to be to do or to succeed. That is why, no matter what, who, who, where you go, no matter the location, no matter the place you you relocate, you will always find ways to succeed. That's why the Bible says, "He is God; He never changes. He is our provider." So they know that as long as you are around them, the God that provides for you will not also allow them to go hunger. Let me tell you why I say so. If you perventure look at the life of Joseph, you got to understand that when Joseph was around his brothers, you know, when they were living together, doing stuff together, many of they were living good, they were living nice. But the moment Joseph leave, they become scared of, they become so terrified. They become so what? Astonished because everything about them because something that that do that have it just be like something that have they, they have never experienced because when Joseph was around them they do used to go hunting they will catch as many as they can they never lack food they never lack anything but the moment Joseph leave many things that have never been in many things that they have never encountered before leave just because of the accent of joseph so what am i trying to say is this many people up there whom you are thinking that they don't need you the real truth is this they will not let you know how deeply they are sorry the way they treated you they will not let you know how important you are because they want to make you feel like you need them you know what I'm saying? but the real truth is this they 
truly need you as badly as they want to breathe. They truly need your presence in order for them to move forward. They truly need your presence in order for them to do well. They truly need your presence in order for them to excel. So without your presence, it is impossible for most of people around you to excel. Without you being around them, you got to understand that many of them will no longer do the things that they do used to do. <laughs> That is why they will never do what make that mistake of letting you go. That's why that's why sometimes you will see some people, mostly those ones who study you, who know that ah, this guy is trying to leave. You come to understand that the moment you start to show them that sign of leaving, they will start to put things in order. <laughs> You just be like, is this is this one the same person that uh, that do used to talk like this? Is this the same person that do used to treat me? They will start to make things to do what to come in order in order for them not to let you go. <laughs> Somebody who do used to tell you, <laughs> but the moment you give them that sign, that green light, you got to understand that they will become so so devastated. Many of them will start to to be panicking. Uh, we want him. We, 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 we want him, he don't need us. Eh, eh, let's reconciliate. Because see, so your accent is absolutely what they need. Not you that need them. You know what I'm saying? So remember, blessed. May God bless you. They truly need you. You don't do what you need them. Remember, blessed. May God bless you.